guys five tips to beat procrastination and being a typical high schooler I have definitely dealt with the struggle or the urge to procrastinate and I'm always looking to improve myself so I've always tried to figure out how to beat procrastination and in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys five of my favorite tips these tips definitely work for me I use them on a daily basis especially with schoolwork Give this video a thumbs up if you also procrastinate. Let's be real, who doesn't procrastinate? Anyway, so that's all I have to say. Let's go ahead and get started. And don't you stop the music into it, won't you dance with me? Find a if you are a person who really likes to just get things done super efficiently and loves to check things off a checklist, then you could definitely benefit from making to-do lists. And what I like to do is every morning I'll make a to-do list for the day and cross things off as I go along. And crossing off things is seriously the best feeling in the world. I promise you guys totally need to make checklists. They are so efficient. <laughs> Eating healthy snacks is super important to increasing your cognitive function and to stay concentrated while studying or doing homework. So I especially like to snack on fresh fruits and nuts. Specifically, I love apples, especially because it is Honeycrisp season and I really love roasted almonds as well. Especially when I'm trying to study for a super hard exam or something, it is definitely nice to have some energy with some healthy snacks. Having a nice and clean workspace is always super crucial to keep my headspace clear if that makes any sense. I find that when my space is super cluttered, I tend to get super scatter minded and I'm just not as productive. So maintaining a clean workspace is super important for me and also sometimes even just switching up your workspace can help to change your mindset to be more productive. Okay, let's get real here. We all face the temptation of distraction, whether that be a video game, a YouTube video, or social media. I challenge you to not only identify your weakest distraction, but also to remove it when you truly need to be getting stuff done. This is definitely super hard for me as I clearly love Snapchatting and surfing social media, but simply deleting these distractions while I work helps immensely for me to increase my productivity. Space one of the most important things you can do to prevent the feelings of discouragement over time is to set and make goals. Personally, I like to write these in my daily planner and highlight them to differentiate them from my other activities. And setting goals will help to provide you not only with motivation and encouragement, but it will definitely help to keep you accountable for getting things done. One of my favorite tips is to just write down some of your most important goals on some sticky notes and stick them in places that you go often. For example, I eat a lot of Cheerios, so I like to stick some of my goals on my Cheerios so every morning when I wake up, I can see my goal and know that I have to accomplish the goal that day and that I have no excuse. While hard work is important, it is just as important to clear your head for a while by taking study breaks. And one of my favorite ways to spend my 15 minute break is just by doing some yoga. And if you tend to get stressed super easily, yoga can definitely help to release some of that stress and is a great way to take a break from studying. So when you do return studying, you can start off with a nice and clear mindset. Okay guys, so that's all for the video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you liked it and let me know which hack or tip was your favorite and leave it in the comments below. I have to say that my favorite hack, which is the hardest hack for sure for me, but is to just delete the social media because that is like my biggest temptation ever. So let me know what your favorite hack was below. Make sure to give them a try out. I challenge you all. Procrastination sucks, so try to beat it with these hacks. <laughs> and thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys!